Hi again. We're back here, back here with Snow. Uh, it's she's had a had a. If you remember what was happening at the end of the last episode, she was having a late night bath before going to bed, and I let her finish doing that and let her sleep. And she's just woken up, desperate to go to the toilet, and starving. So it's uh, yes, it's time to go to the bathroom. Come on. And we don't need to have another bath because we just had one like eight hours ago. And get some fruit salad for breakfast. And just check the weather. E, you'll be pleased to hear that it's still another two days of rain. So you can enjoy listening to my narration over the constant rain sound. Yay. Don't wash your hands. You're clean enough. I think today we'll go on a little reconnoiter to Willow Creek to find us some, some more seeds because it seems like uh, Brindleton Bay is mostly bereft of seeds and we need seeds if we're going to be snow white living off the land. We can't survive on nap nip, alo nap -nip alone. That reminds me, we might breed our frog. See if we get something interesting. Nope. We'll look for frogs while we're in Willow Creek, I think. What's that? Why is that my inventory? Alright, clean up. Get dressed. We're going out. Okay, we're going to go travel, not with anyone. Going to Willow Creek. Um, I think the best place for stuff is around this area. Yeah, this house I think has quite a lot of stuff at the back. Of course it's raining. It's raining in Willow Creek just like it was raining in Brindleton Bay. What's that snapdragon? Maybe we'll go visit the fairyland. Maybe it won't be raining there. Harvest bluebells. Finally, something worth har something to harvest, not just worth harvesting. Something that's not ungrown. Ungrown. Not sure ungrown's a really word. And of course, it's summer, so nothing much is growing. Even though, even with all this pouring rain. What have we got here today? Harvest chrysanthemums, yay! More chrysanthemums, they're worth plenty. I don't think the apple tree's in season, no, it's definitely not in season. Oh, it's a food stall. What's that? Oh, something to dig. Come on over, snow. Run through the pouring rain. It's a mushroom plant that we can't dig because it's not in season. What have we got in this hole? Mud hole probably. Yes. We're gonna rain a time capsule. So that'll be seventy dollars. Okay. Before she gets any more rained on, let's see what there is out here. Nothing on the nature strip. Well, it's not this, but the nature strip. 
Yep, there's one. Now there's bluebells. Now we've gone full circle. Is there anything down here that's placed a fish? What's that? Mushrooms that haven't grown. Oh, I think that's a diggy spot. Yes, that's a diggy spot. It's a, probably a no it's snapdragon that I can't harvest. More bluebells. Gonna have lots of bluebells. It's a shame they're not as expensive as the chrysanthemums. Is that the same bluebell bush that no, there's another one over here. Alright, we've got a list of things to look at. Ooh. That's my other house that I've been playing. Snow will eventually have a line of garden plants just like them. And I think that's all there is going to be. Yeah, I already did that side of the road. There's snow. <sighs> yes, I know. You're getting very, you're getting very wet. You look like a drowned rat. Unfortunately, you can't have an umbrella because it'll get struck by lightning, and that's a waste of money. And you can't wait until it stops raining because that's like a whole week of sitting and in, sitting around inside doing nothing. Mm, upgrade parts. Oh, the bikini frog things. We didn't see any frog things. I think there's frogs behind one of these houses. Somewhere. Maybe. Maybe not. I thought there was frogs back here somewhere. There's another spot to dig. There's one of those frogs here somewhere. Am I just blind? There's another spot to dig, yes. I missed a couple of spots to dig, but I don't see those frogs. I could have sworn there was frogs here somewhere. Maybe it's in here? No. I've got a snapdragon that hasn't grown. No. I must have misremembered it. Now we'll go visit the magic tree. Oh, what did we find in our another time capsule in cell and that's it more more um what do you call it plumbing parts <coughs> it says to water and it shows a rain cloud well yes I don't think it needs much more water than it's already getting Turn up the game audio, it's a bit quiet. And save while I'm here. That's better. Now you can hear the lovely ASMR like quality of rain running in the background. Compliment on leaves. See if I can remember the maze to get to the magic land. Do I follow the sound or the light? Can't remember. Um, try sound.
Yay! Now, I'm reasonably sure it's follow upstream. Reasonably sure. Like, 65% sure. Come on, upstream. Ow! Damn it! Uh, don't be embarrassed, it's my fault, I can't remember what I'm doing. Come on. No, ignore the stupid thunder. It's not going to get you. You're on a humongous tree that's probably got some algorithm to stop the lightning from hitting it. Otherwise, surely the lightning would hit that more often than... Oh, so maybe we'll try to follow the light. And don't get so embarrassed you die. One would think it would be difficult to get lost in a mythical... Ah, it was full of the sound. So obviously you, follow, you go downstream, not upstream. Damn it. Oh, stop, stop worrying about the lunder. Thun the lunder. Thunder and lightning. Come on, last time. Follow the sound and go downstream. Taking the path of least resistance and hoping that it doesn't terminate at a sewer main, snow is distracted by an ethereal mist glowing ominously. Into the mist, I think. I think. I hope. Come on, into the mist. I should have looked this up before I started. Oh, the mist is warm and friendly, as far as mists go. Without warning, snow feels the sensation of being spun around an exit to the cave now staring her in the face. Travel to Glade. Oh good, finally. Yes, I want to go to the centre to the Glade. Yay, oh it's not raining. Woohoo! Don't look so sad, you're in a mythical, mystical, not raining Glade where the light's kind of pink. Let's see if we can find anything Harvest. I don't remember it being pink last time I was here. Have they changed this? Hmm. I'll pause it so that she's not standing there doing nothing for hours while I search for harvestables. Shame you can't go swimming in these. Waters. I'm sure, it would be lovely to swim here. Oh, that's something. Something that hasn't grown yet, of course. Of course. Why would I be so silly to think that enough time had passed for the harvestables to be harvestable? What's that? Blueberry. We don't need any more flaming bluebells. We've got to wait. 30. That's the magic tree. Pear tree that is also not available. Hmm. What's that? That's just a root. Looks like, like, a, looks like a giant, um, what do you call those things on boats? Steering wheel thing? With the spokes, I can't remember what they're called. Mm, no, this looks like a wasted trip. At least I remember how to get in there. Nothing has grown. Oh well. Well, we can do some fishing. Get another. Get ourselves another, another fish. 
Where's the fishing spot? Oh, there it is. So nice and sunny. Beautiful calm water near the waterfall. Should definitely be able to go swimming in here, like you can in Salani. Catch us a nice fish when you dry off in the sun. And she's still dripping. Two hours. Mm, fish? Mm, nope. Lovely log. Forty-eight bluebells. I underestimated. A frog, frog spot. We're doing that next, and then we might find a mutant frog that's worth a lot. Come on, fish! Give us one fish, and then we'll get the frog. Come on, gently, gently. Don't scare it away. Come on, that looks like a bite. Maybe. Should be able to catch. I reckon we should be able to catch the fairies that are floating around. Come on, come on. Yes, fish. That's enough fishing. We got a trout. Oh, dummy. Twenty-one dollar worth of trout. I think that's something to sell. <laughs> You're not going to find a treasure che treasure chest in there, unfortunately. It's only worth ten dollars. Why is it only worth ten dollars? Why can't I find a nicer one? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know that trout looks like salmon, does it? I don't know. I'm not that familiar with fish when they still have skin on them. Mm, sell. Which one do I sell? Eggplant or the Really do. I'll keep them both until we see what happens when I breed the surfer leaf one with the striped dirt frog. Alright, time to go home. Come on. Why aren't we going? Level up in fishing school. Oh, well, we're trying. Say goodbye to the pretty plants. Hello to the pouring rain again. Might go inside and get ourselves some lunch. How much? How many serves have we got left? Three left. Is it time to breed? It's not time to breed yet. Come on, Snow, what are you doing? Oh! Damn paddles! Hmm, that tree's got a good sway on it. I don't remember noticing them sway that much before. And when you're done 
with that we will have another bath there's so much more time in the day when you don't have to have multiple baths because you keep falling over in the mud or deciding that the most fun thing to do is go and play in the mud and once we've had our bath I think we'll continue with our uh, cooking instructions oh can we do anything with our nap nap has it grown yet oh it has oh nine whole dollars we'll do that before you go and have a bath um, I don't think we need to keep the nap nap so we'll just sell it for nine dollars Yes, slipping in a mud puddle means that mud gets everywhere, everywhere. It might be time for a shower. It is definitely time for a shower. We need to go to the toilet? No. Take a normal bath. And then read your cookbook. Oh, I should have planted the bluebells and the chrysanthemums while we were out there. Hmm. You still embarrassed? Oh, eight hours. Well, it was two hours when you were in the Sylvan Glade. Why has it gotten worse? No one even saw. Why are you so embarrassed? Why are you embarrassed when people notice you're doing stupid things? blown up this time. Oh dear. Nothing, maybe. Hmm. Hopefully. Still got the blown up chair and the blown up washing line. Oh damn it, it's blown up my bee box. Stupid bloody lightning. Turn off the damn lightning. We don't need this much lightning. It's ridiculous. How much is that to replace? $265. I was just about to say, we've got over $700. We could, when the rain stops, we're going to replace the, lo the washing line. No problem. <sighs> now we're going to replace the bee box as well. Stop overreacting. Where am I even supposed to put all my stuff that's outside? I mean, who, who brings their bees inside when it's raining? Next it'll be my washing bucket. He's on fine. No, I'm not joining the renegades. I'm not a renegade. And seeing as you've got the good trait, I don't understand why you're a renegade either. Oh, good. This, reading this book is giving us fun, so that's good. Doing household things feels so natural on this lot. Which household things exactly? Now who's on the phone? No, I'm not going to the talent showcase. Anna, this is what you can look forward to with your new pack. Lightning. Uh, lightning attacking your outdoor furniture. Isn't it fun? It's much better when the summer is actually summery. Instead of being 
more like winter. Halfway through summer. What are you doing? Why do you need a pep talk? Are you still embarrassed? No, tell yourself you're overreacting. Nobody even saw. Yes, nobody saw. It's all fine. Um, did, we, did we get close to finishing that skill? Not really. Might. Yes, who are we going to call? I was just about to. No, we don't want to browse the web. We are calling our buddy. Who's our buddy? Oh, we've got a couple of buddies. We'll call Morgan. That made you feel better? You could do it with another call, I think. No, you, no, stop playing in the... You just had a bath. Oh, you're so stupid. I'm calling up Morgan again. More chatting. More chatting, less getting filthy. Come inside. Come inside. Stay away from the puddles and the mud and the rain. You're not going out to play in the puddles. I'll lock you in the house if I have to. It's like having a naughty dog. So, no, you don't hear me, mail. Oh, dear. Is there anything else we can do? We can put, continue reading our cookbook. And then it'll be bedtime. How did that pet talk work for you? Still embarrassed. <laughs> Is that making you hungry? We nearly finished the skill. Alright, you want to go to bed. Alright, alright. I'll let you go to bed. Well, that wasn't a humongously successful day. Still everything's in the green, but didn't quite get everything we wanted done. And we're up again. Don't really need to go to the toilet or have a shower. Yes, so that's exactly what I was going to tell you to do. Get some fruit salad. Is it still raining? No, it's not still raining. What's the weather today? Cloudy with thunderstorms.
Oh, before you even have a shower. Oh, what day is it? Oh, Stuart, talk like a pirate day. <sighs> that probably means I have to go out. Find some people to pirate talk to. Um, anyway, what was I going to do? Plant those flowers that we picked up yesterday. Oh, and we can breed our sun surfer frog. Is it? Maybe sun surfer leaf frog. Something. And try it with the dirt frog. All it did was give us another surfer leaf frog. Right. Later we'll try it with the eggplant frog. Maybe we'll get a different frog. That's the nap nap that I'm going to use as uh, fertilizer once I've discovered the joys of fertilizer. Oop. Where's the one over there? What the hell? Over here. Why aren't you going where I want you to go? Is that not our yard anymore? Ah, that might be it. I forgot about the boundary of the yard. Nope, that's the boundary of the yard. Alright, well, we'll go here. Like that. Come come back, what are you doing? And since it's no longer raining, we can plant the uh, water that. And sell the nap nip. Not so water that. Oh, well, you didn't say water all, so I told you to water it, even though you didn't know you were going to do it already. Toilet, bath. Oh, we're going to early start on the day today. It's already s only 7 in the morning. Is there going to be any more thunderstorms? Because I might. Yes, it's going to be thunderstorms all week. This is the worst summer that I've ever seen on The Sims before. I was going to say I'll replace the bee box and move it towards the flowers so that they pollinate the flowers, but if we're going to have another whole week of thunderstorms, I'm not sure, I'm not sure there's any point. There's that thing that I had dug over here. Once you've had your shower, come and dig that spot. Might as well harvest the nap nip and sell it for two dollars a pop. Oh look at that, it's raining again. Maybe we'll skip the the digging and the harvesting of the nap nip. We'll just go go to Oasis Springs. It won't be raining in Oasis Springs and there's different things to harvest there. Well, it probably won't be raining in Oasis Springs. No, we don't want to go with anyone. Yeah. Where are the harvestables? Uh, can't remember, I don't play here very often. We'll start at the to town centre, city area. Retail area, that's what it is, not oh, city centre. Look, yes, it's so warm we had to change to our summer outfit. Yay. Starting to think we wouldn't get to use it this whole summer. search for some frogs. Maybe Oasis Springs is going to be a lucky lucky town for finding decent frogs. 
So let's just the edge of a bush. Where am I? I think I already came this way. Yeah, that's the bar where we're at. It's over here. Or is that the no. No, we didn't look at this side of the road. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's bad. Nothing, there is nothing. More frogs. Please tell me they're not the same frogs. Ooh, a roller skating rink. We might go have a run, run, roll around if we've looked for frogs and other harvestables which again seem to be totally missing <sighs> did I take that fish? oh no I've sold that fish so I don't have to worry about taking it out of my pocket because it's not in my pocket anymore Alright, well we've got a couple of frogs to look for. I think that's all we're going to get. I'm not going to bother fishing, we've got plenty of fish. It takes too long to actually catch one. And then you possibly get in to catch one that's worth six dollars. Alright, what was I going to do? I was going to roll skate after, we, after I got my frogs. And what's the roller skating thingy? There. Randomly in the car park. It's a strange place to put a roller skating rink. Come on, expensive frog. We need an expensive frog. A whirly flower frog. What is that? Is that a good frog? Finally, please. Oh, yes! Excellent. $160. Have we? Now we know we haven't got breeding. Can't breed yet. Let's see what else we find. Can we put shoes on? I did remember to give you shoes, didn't I? Oh, just oh yeah, nice shoes. I see a, I think I see a, I do see a thing to dig. Sorry, I have to delay the, the rock in the way. You know the way, rock. Delay the roller skating for a moment while we go and dig up something valuable, hopefully. What's that? I see chrysanthemums. It's amazing how you can never find what you want to find when you want to find it. What do we get? Uh, time capsule. Seventy dollars is inside. That's what's inside. Now we're going roll skating. Yes. Yep. That looks particularly painful. Yep. <laughs> Yay, breed frog with striped dirt frog, eggplant frog, surfily frog. Hey. Oh, where did I get two striped dirt frogs from? Oh, because I'm oh, such an idiot. I went to the second. Yay, now we can sell a whole ton of these stupid cheap frogs. Bye bye to that frog. Not that one. Or that one. Bye bye to those two. And bye bye to that one. Oh, we can talk like a pirate to this woman if she's not an old person. Is she an old person? Oh, no, she's not. Old. Oh, 
I want it. I want it. Click on you. Can't we talk while we skate? Maybe not. Why didn't I sell the? Did I plant? I planted the bluebells. Why didn't I sell the rest of them? And the chrysanthemums. Chrysanthemums. I can't say that. Oh, bye bye. Ooh, I'm up to a thousand dollars. Practically rolling in it. <laughs> Unintended pun. Ooh, there's more things to dig. I love how the roller skates go on and off. Except now I'm wearing black boots that I wasn't wearing before. <laughs> okay, slight slight glitch. Oh, the shoes changed back. What did I get this time? Limestone with a fossil inside. Uh-huh. Now, let's go talk like a pirate to that lady. Hopefully she hasn't disappeared. Oh, she bloody well disappeared. That is just perfect. Where did she run off to? Why did she run away? We haven't... Oh, there's a lady. No, that's one of those stupid... Yeah, that's a star. Hmm. Hmm. Which building did we visit? I can't remember where we came in. The rattlesnake bar. Where's the rattlesnake bar gone? Ah. It's not those two. There it is. No, I'm not, not a fan of the bar, but we'll go to the bar just to find somebody to talk like a pirate to. And then we'll go home. Very happy with the day's takings. Oh, look, we make footprints in the sand everywhere we go. I didn't notice that before. I wonder if that's, that might be new since, um, what's that? Mm, daisy bush. Um, that might be new since, uh, seasons. Because they brought in footprints for seasons in the, er, in the snow. So that might be new, and also in the rain. So that might be new that now we can see footprints on most surfaces, soft surfaces. You're not wearing a whole lot of clothing there, Pari. And um, horn swaggle. It's the problem with talk about pirate. I'm not exactly sure what horn swaggle is. It might be something along the lines of lie about something. Let's sing about it. And share the excitement. And not going to complain about it. Ask ear the wind blows. Oh, I got level one of the singing skill by singing at that pirate day. Snow acquired the singing skill. Snow can improve her skill by clicking on a microphone or on herself and then selecting practicing practice singing. She can now select sing solo for house jazz and pop songs and can sing country by selecting sing duet duet using the karaoke machine. No, that's not like one. She might sing with her dwarf children, but I don't think she's going to be going to karaoke bar anytime soon. Did we finish Talk Like a Pirate Day? No, not quite. No. There's the pirate's 
things. Come on. It's hardly any pirate any funny. Nope. Alright, we'll just ask that again. Nope. Come on. You need to talk like a pirate a bit more. Where are you going? Mm, well, we'll get to know you a bit better. I'll ask about Korea. Tell a tale of the sea. You're not old, are you? No, you were the adult that I nearly saw. Ahoy, me matey. Yay, we finally did it. Yep. Oh, Woohoo! Alright, before any old women around arrive, we're going home. And I've now been recording for half an hour or more than half an hour. So I'm going to stop this episode and continue on with the second one, or well, the second one of today, immediately. So come back in the come back in the next video to see what the rest of Snow's Day holds for her. See you later.